Moving on to the third problem. Is it possible to design a rectangular mango groove whose length is twice its breadth and the area is 800 meter square? If so, find its length and breadth. Let us see the solution. Assume the breadth of the rectangular groove to be x meters. Therefore, the length becomes twice the breadth which is 2 times of x meters. 2x meters. We know that area of the rectangle is equal to length times of breadth. Length is 2x meters and breadth is x meters. So area becomes 2x times of x meters square. According to the given question, area is given as 800 meters square. So 2x times of x is equal to 800. This is 2x square and this is 800. So x square is equal to 800 divided by 2 which is 400. x is equal to plus or minus root of 400. So we can say x is equal to plus or minus 20. Since x is a dimension, x is equal to minus 20 can be ignored. So we get the value of x as only plus 20 that is breadth is equal to 20 meters and length is 2 times of breadth which is 2 times of 20 nothing but 40 meters therefore the breadth is equal to 20 meters and length is equal to 40 meters Hence, it is possible to design rectangular mango group with the given conditions. Moving on to the fourth problem, is the following situation possible? If so, determine their percentages. The sum of the ages of two friends is 20 years, 4 years ago. The product of their ages in years was 48. Let us see the solution. Assume age of first friend is equal to x year. Then age of second friend becomes 20 minus x years because sum of their ages is equal to 20 years. According to the given condition, 4 years ago, the product of their ages in years was 48. 4 years ago, age of first friend is equal to 4x minus 4 years. 4 years ago, age of second friend is equal to Twenty minus x minus four years, which is nothing but sixteen minus x years. The product is equal to forty-eight. X minus four multiplied by sixteen minus x is equal to forty-eight. So we can write x times of sixteen minus x minus four times of 16 minus x is equal to 48. Now this becomes 16x minus x square minus 64 plus 4x is equal to 48. Minus x square 16x plus 4x is 20x minus 64 and transposing 48 to left hand side we get minus 48 is equal to 0. So minus x square plus 20x this is minus 112 is equal to 0. This equation can also be written as x square minus 20x plus 112 is equal to 0. Comparing this equation with the standard equation ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 
we get a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 20 and c is equal to 112 let us find the discriminant b square minus 4ac which is nothing but minus 20 whole square minus 4 times of 1 multiplied by 112 which is nothing but 400 minus 4 times of 112 is minus 448 and this is equal to minus 48 which is less than 0 the discriminant b square minus 4ac is less than 0 hence the equation has no real roots therefore the given situation is not possible